Hi and welcome. My name is Julianne Cost, and in this quick tip I'm going to show you an easy way to add type on top of a photograph while screening back the photograph so that you can really still read the text. Now in order to do this I'm going to change the template here using the template picker. I'm actually going to select one of the text pages template. We'll add this one because it allows me the largest text cell and I already have some text copied to the clipboard, so I'll use Command V to paste in this poem. Now, you can see that the poem is a little bit too long, so I could select all and then go to my type panel and decrease the size of it, but then it gets almost too small to read. So what I would prefer to do is actually break the poem into two columns. So down here I'll use my column slider to add a secondary column, but now I don't like the way that the columns break. So if I want to adjust that, well first I'm going to increase the point of my size to 10 points, and then I'm going to use the cell panel. I will unlink the padding and I'm going to bring the poem down a little bit from the top using the slider, and then I'll bring it up from the bottom until I find a break in the type that I like, and I think right there is going to work for me. The only problem is I don't have a photograph. So how do I add a photograph to this text-based template? Well, I can do that using the background panel. I can apply the background globally, which would apply this image to all of the pages, but I don't want that in this instance, so I'll uncheck that, and then I'll select the photograph that I want and drag and drop it right here. You can see that it's automatically screened back to 20%, which is quite legible because of the screened back photograph underneath. So there you have it, an easy way to add text on top of an image in the book module in Lightroom. I'm Julianne, thanks for watching.